Hello, and welcome to our video about the dangers of popcorn brain. In today's world, we are surrounded by short-form videos, from TikTok to Instagram Reels, and it's easy to fall into the trap of spending hours mindlessly scrolling through these videos. But did you know that this can have serious negative effects on your brain? In this video, we'll explore the concept of popcorn brain and explain why it's important to be mindful of our short-form video consumption. What is popcorn brain? First, let's define popcorn brain. It's a term used to describe the phenomenon of being overstimulated by fast-paced information, to the point where our brain circuitry starts to pop from the constant stimulation. This can make it difficult for us to disconnect from our devices, as we become habituated to the constant streaming of information. Negative Effects of Popcorn Brain So, what are the negative effects of popcorn brain? Well, for starters, it can lead to difficulty concentrating and focusing on one task at a time. Our brains become so used to the constant stimulation of short-form videos that we can find it hard to slow down and focus on longer tasks that require sustained attention. Additionally, spending too much time consuming short-form videos can impact our memory and creativity. It's easy to forget what we've just watched or to be unable to recall important information, as our brains are constantly being bombarded with new and often irrelevant information. Finally, popcorn brain can lead to feelings of anxiety and stress. The constant stimulation of short-form videos can leave us feeling overwhelmed and unable to switch off, leading to a constant state of hyperarousal. How to avoid popcorn brain? So, what can we do to avoid popcorn brain and its negative effects? Firstly, it's important to be mindful of our short-form video consumption. Try setting limits on the amount of time you spend watching these videos, and make sure to take regular breaks. It can also be helpful to schedule specific times of the day for short-form video consumption, rather than mindlessly scrolling throughout the day. Late morning and early evening are good times for this, as they don't interfere with the start or end of our day. Finally, try to engage in activities that stimulate your brain in other ways. Reading, exercising, or doing puzzles can all help to counteract the negative effects of short-form video addiction. Conclusion In conclusion, popcorn brain is a real phenomenon that can have serious negative effects on our brains. By being mindful of our short-form video consumption and taking steps to avoid overstimulation, we can protect our brains and avoid the negative effects of this addiction. Thank you for watching.